I'm Matthew McAuliffe and here are your latest headlines from churchmilitant.tv news. The presidential debate last night may have a victor, but not by much, according to instant polls taken right after it aired. A CBS survey of undecided voters reports a whopping 33% of undecided voters thought the debate was a tie with 37% proclaiming Obama as the victor and 30% seeding Romney with a win. The Weekly Standard is also reminding readers that it's the first debate that matters most historically in its report on the debate that came out early this morning pointing out Obama's performance last night is not the game changer he is looking for. The head of the Vatican's Pontifical Council on Peace and Justice is being excoriated at the Synod in Rome for showing a video on Muslim demographics that warns of an impending cultural takeover by Islam. Cardinal Peter Turkson's video, Muslim Demographics, was criticized by bishops as a call to arms for Christians, prompting His Eminence to apologize. This video, which has received over 13.5 million views on YouTube since it was published in 2009, talks about the replacement rate of Europeans versus the immigration of, of Muslims in Europe and can be viewed on our resource blog post by clicking on the link right outside the screen. The Synod taking place in Rome, opening the Year of Faith, will be sending a delegation to Syria. It was announced this week. Cardinal Secretary of State Tarsicio Bertone announced the delegation as a humanitarian mission with a personal offering from the Synodal Fathers and the Holy See to express support for Christians there. Father Frank Pavone is officially back in the realm of culture wars after what the Huffington Post refers to as a, quote, year in exile. Asked about his comment condemning Cardinal Dolan for inviting Obama to the Al Smith dinner coming up this Thursday, Pavone says, quote, Some people call me too aggressive. Well, too bad, end quote. You can read more about what Father Pavone and Priests for Life are doing regarding the upcoming election and happenings in the church on our resource page by clicking on the link right outside the screen. A pro-homosexual, quote, splinter denomination of the Catholic Church, as the media calls it, has come into existence claiming to be a, quote, Catholic community outside the institutional church. This is a place where so-called sacramental limitations on marriage and ordination are rejected and female priests are allowed, according to the organization's website. The group has a total of seven parishes in six states. I'm Matthew McAuliffe. Those are your headlines from churchmilitant.tv. Make sure you check out today's Vortex, where Michael addresses a cardinal's conundrum and calls for prayers on his behalf. Thanks for tuning in today. Spread the word about us to your friends, and may God bless you.